Lots of sunshine today and what a difference from yesterday when we were just socked in with the gray skies and the rain and the chilly air. How about this beautiful view right now of South Haven, South Beach. Right now we're about well, 25 minutes away from sunset and what a gorgeous view looking like a postcard out there. Well, we do have some big changes coming, but they're not going to get here until later in the week. So let's go over them. It's our next weather maker. It's what's heading our way next. This area of low pressure heading our way for Wednesday into Thursday. Now Wednesday, Thursday looking good. But Thursday night, this will start knocking on our door here. Stop that clock at about 1030 Wednesday night or Thursday night, Thursday night, when we start to see a little bit of snow moving through. As this low continues to approach, it's going to be bringing more of that snow for Friday morning into Friday afternoon. And so basically Friday, I think, is going to be a snowy day and then it jets right on out of here by Friday night. There are similarities to the storm from last week. One, of course, it's occurring on a Friday. Two, it looks like it'll be bringing some accumulating snow. Three, it's gonna be out of here by late Friday night, early Saturday morning. But there are some important differences as well. Uh, one of them is that this will be spread out over a longer period of time. So I don't think it will be quite as intense. And this particular model that we're looking at would call for snow totals that are a little less than some of the major impacts that we had last Friday when some folks got up to nearly a foot. I know a lot of folks didn't see much at all, just depending on where you were. But we're looking at largely about three to five inches. Now, this could change with the track changing and with even the timing. So let's talk about what we're confident about here, and that is confident that there will be a storm moving in here Friday that will be bringing some accumulating snow with some gusty wind. And the roads will be worsening during the day. What's still to be worked out? The precise storm track, which will, of course, have something to say about how much snow will be coming down and whether there'll be any rain mixing in with that snow. We're still three days out, something that we'll continue to work on to keep you alert. Let's look live. Downtown Kalamazoo, nothing like that right now. Clear. It's beautiful out there with our Peregrine Tower camera looking right down the Kalamazoo Mall where it's 45 degrees. We have mid 40s across a good portion of the area, including South Haven, where we were looking live. The coldest spots right now up and down I-69 over to Sturgis and up to Ionia when we're about 38 to 40. All quiet on live Doppler radar. That's the case for tonight, too. Starry sky, typical of 25. We'll be a little below that. So it's a coat morning tomorrow for sure. Sunny tomorrow and jacket chilly. How about a high like today? Around 46 degrees. On to your Sealy Auto Group seven day forecast. More clouds for Thursday. Looks like a snowman coming in here for Friday. The weekend looking pretty good. Don't forget, we turn those clocks on Sunday.